IIT Gandhinagar 2020. The institution we are featuring today was established in 2008. It is one of the second generation IITs. This year, it has achieved the 24th rank on the NIRF table. Welcome to College Suggest. In this video, we're taking a look at the Indian Institute of Technology, Gandhinagar. We're looking at its student stats, courses, its performance in graduation, placements, median salary, top recruiter, the infrastructure, and of course, the fee structure. We're also comparing the performance of IIT Gandhinagar with IIT Indore, IIT Patna, and IIT Roper to see if it's performing on par with its peers. Click on the subscribe button and the bell icon to receive notifications on your favorite college details, college comparisons, courses, careers, and so much more. As always, we will only consider the facts that are submitted by the college to the NIRF for the 2020 ranking. We leave the link in the description below. Teaching, Learning and Resources Here, we'll take a look at IIT Gandhinagar's approved intake, its student strength, faculty information and financial utilizations. IIT Gandhinagar has an approved intake of 194 UG seats and 190 PG seats. This shows that IIT Gandhinagar's UG intake is quite low when compared to its peers, while their PG intake is higher. This institution has 952 engineering students across all years and across the programs, which is lower compared to its closest competitors. To cater to these students, IIT Gandhinagar has a total of 87 faculty members and 98.85% of them hold a doctorate. With this, IIT Gandhinagar has a faculty to student ratio of 1 is to 11, which is quite lower when compared to other similar institutions. Last year, six professors from IIT Gandhinagar received highly reputed national and international awards for their research and performance from various government agencies. And 34 students have won awards in the past year. When it comes to capital expenses, IIT Gandhinagar has spent over 36 crores, out of which a huge portion went toward the purchasing of new lab equipment. Other institutions have also invested most of their capital expenses on the purchase of new lab equipment. Over 102 crores were spent as operational expenses, and a huge portion of this went towards the maintenance of academic infrastructure. Most of its peers have also invested a huge amount on the maintenance and the salaries of the staff. Considering all of these, IIT Gandhinagar has scored 83.76% in teaching, learning and resources, which contributes to 30% of the overall NIRF score. Research and Professional Practices In this parameter, we'll see about IIT Gandhinagar's PhD students, patent details and the funds received through various projects. IIT Gandhinagar published two patents last year. However, no patent has been granted in recent years. We can see that IIT Gandhinagar's performance with regard to the patents is quite low when compared to most of its peers. With a total of 196 sponsored projects, IIT Gandhinagar has received over 31 crores as sponsored research funds. With 62 consultancy projects, it has received over 7 crores in consultancy funds. IIT Gandhinagar has a total of 200 students pursuing their PhDs and 16 scholars have graduated with a PhD which is lower compared to its peers. With this performance, IIT Gandhinagar has scored 34.55% in research and professional practices. This contributes to 30% of the NIRF score. Graduation Outcomes Here, let's analyze IIT Gandhinagar's graduation and placement percentages along with salary packages and top recruiters. UG IIT Gandhinagar offers six UG programs. While looking at IIT Gandhinagar's UG program, among the 139 final year students, 120 graduated within the minimum stipulated time. This gives a graduation percentage of 86.33%. From these graduates, 21 students have chosen to study further. Upon looking closer, IIT Gandhinagar's graduation percentage is quite low compared to other institutes of the same range. Among the 99 students eligible for placements, 58 students got placed in various companies, achieving a placement percentage of 58.58%. These placed students were given a salary package of 7.25 lakhs per annum. IIT Gandhinagar's placement and salary packages are again lower compared to its peers. Over the years, IIT Gandhinagar's performance in graduation has improved, while the placements have shown a drop. 
IIT Gandhinagar also offers eight PG programs. For a detailed analysis of its PG performance, please visit the link in the description below. Some of the reputed organizations that hire students from IIT Gandhinagar are Ericsson, Flipkart, Samsung, HDFC, Honda, Infosys, Vipro, Microsoft, Virtuosa, and many more. With this, IIT Gandhinagar has scored 55.15% in graduation outcomes, which contributes to 20% of the NIRF score. Outreach and Inclusivity Here we will look at just how diverse the institution is. Out of the total 952 students studying across all years and all programs at IIT Gandhinagar, 141 students are from within the state, 808 students from other parts of the country, and 3 students are from abroad. Just like other similar IITs, IIT Gandhinagar also has a high number of students from other parts of the country, making it one of the diverse institutions. The overall student count includes 85.29% of boys and 14.71% of girls. Considering all of these, IIT Gandhinagar has scored 57.9% for outreach and inclusivity, which contributes to 10% of the NIRF scores. Perception In this parameter, let's look at the perception of this institution from the public and its peers. IIT Gandhinagar is one among the top technical institutions in the country and it has scored 38.26% in perception from the public. Perception contributes to 10% of the NIRF scores. Comprising all of the scores in various parameters, IIT Gandhinagar has attained an overall score of 56.15%. When we look at the institution's rank, it has improved from the past year. Admission IIT Gandhinagar admits students to UG and PG programs through JEE Advanced and GATE scores respectively. Location IIT Gandhinagar is located in Palaj, Gujarat. The nearest railway station to the institution is the Ahmedabad Junction, which is 29 kilometers away. The nearest airport with international connectivity is the Sadar Vallabhai Patel International Airport, which is 21.4 kilometers away. Campus Life IIT Gandhinagar spreads over 400 acres, while other institutions have a larger campus area compared to IIT Gandhinagar. The campus consists of institute buildings, shops, separate hostels for boys and girls, a library, and various other facilities to support the needs of the students. The institution also has facilities for sports like cricket, football, volleyball, basketball, tennis, and various indoor games. Blithkron is the annual cultural festival of IIT Gandhinagar. Apart from the cultural festival, the institution also organizes various technical events to enrich the knowledge of the students. Fee Structure The approximate fees for the UG students per semester is Rs. 1,53,000, which is higher than the other IITs of the same range. Please note that the fee structure mentioned is subject to variation. Approximately, one pays around 12.24 lakhs as an overall fee. The median salary offered to the place students is 7.25 lakhs per annum, which means that you can earn back the fee amount that you paid within 1.5 years of graduation. Upon looking at all of the facts and the performance of IIT Gandhinagar, a few of the picks from the institution are an improved graduation percentage, a diverse campus, an efficient team of faculty members, research and development needs some improvement, and an expensive fee structure. So there you have it, that's all you need to know about IIT Gandhinagar. What other interesting college reviews would you like to see? Let us know in the comment section below. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and for more information, visit collegesuggest.com.